Hi guys, it's Matilda here, that's me. Um, I was going to film a get ready with me video, but the light in this bathroom sucks. What is this airplane? Um, if I have the light on, it's super yellow, and if I have it off, the quality goes bad. Um, I guess I'm gonna try to find, I'll try to sit by like a window or something. But before we do that, I'm just gonna prep my skin. I love sounding like I know what I'm doing. Like when I say prep my skin, I love that it sounds like, you know, I have it all under control. I don't. Okay, so I have a few different things I like to do. I've already like obviously moisturized my face. I love the Dr. Barbara Sturm Glow Drops. I also love the Tata Harper Illuminating Moisturizer and the Illuminating Eye Cream. Um, so what I like to do is use a little eye cream. I'm like very scared to put on eye cream on YouTube. Damn it, I think it just opened up for critique on how I put my eye cream on. The thing is, I try to be really gentle, but I also don't have any patience, so that's that. And little goes a really, really long way when it comes to this eye cream. And then I either use the glow drops or I will use the Tata Harper illuminating cream. So they kind of like, I feel like they do the same thing the Dr. Barbara Serm Glow Drops. I feel like it gives me a glow. And then this one has more of like a shimmery kind of like feel to it, which I very much enjoy, I'm not going to lie. Maybe I'll do the glow drops. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put the glow drops all over my face. And then I am going to put the, the Tata Harper on the high points of my face. And then I'll just use a little bit of this this is what it looks like, the Tata Harper Illuminating Moisturizer. So you can use this all over your face or you can use it like, you know, on targeted areas. I think I'm just gonna use it right here now then. The more glow, the better. No, but in all seriousness, I feel like my skin has felt kind of like dull lately. Like it just feels really, I think I need to go and get a facial. It just feels really like, it needs love and when I've been in our summer house, it has not gotten any love at all. Because all I do is swim in the ocean and forget to wash my face. Do you think my face likes that? No. I'm going to take my big makeup bag. This is by Tina Kua. And then I'm going to take my little makeup bag by Tata Hertford. Well, funny thing, it's not really makeup. I think it's basically just skincare. I am definitely more of like a skincare freak rather than like a makeup freak, which you guys probably already know. Okay. I'm taking this with me and we're gonna go and find better light. This is gonna have to work. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cover this annoying thing. We love all of our sits, but we do find that one a bit annoying. Can you guys tell that I like this? So this is a Trini London BFF serum in color Josie, I believe. I have like had it for so long. Ooh, I got some out. Okay, so what I'm gonna try to do is I'm like, it's not that I hate it. I just, you know, would like to cover it up a little bit. I like try to be friends with my pimples and not hate them too much. Cause you know, I spent too much time hating pimples when I was younger. So now I just try to be at peace with them. This little dude is one of those pimples that hurt really bad though, like a pain. And as I'm putting this concealer on, I am noticing that it's a bit pale for my tan summer face. Well, that sucks, because I don't have any other concealer. Let's move on over to bronzer. So, if you have followed me for a bit, you know that I've like been on the lookout, on the hunt for a really good bronzer. And I have now found it. Well, I've actually found a few of them. Okay, but I'm gonna show you my favorite one. My absolute favorite bronzer, the Refi Beauty in color tan. It looks, maybe like a little bit orangey, but I am so obsessed. And when I say that I'm obsessed, I've never had a bronzer that I love this much. Not sponsored or anything. I'm just a true fan, a true fan of her stuff. Okay, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of this on. So it's cream-based, which you guys know I'm all about, but it's not just cream-based. It's not like shimmery, it doesn't have any like weird glitter in it. It is just the best bronzer. If you haven't tried it, you need to. That's, that's all I have to say. 
Okay, truly the best bronzer in the game. Um, Refi Beauty, color tan. And then the brush I'm using is from Kaya. It's the F04. Also a really, really good um, brush. And now we're going into blush, which I actually have a really hard time with nowadays because I have so many that I love. It's like I can never decide which one to use. Do you want me to show you? I'm hoping, I'm hoping you're nodding your head. Okay, so first of all, we have the ones from Merit Beauty that I love. The color Beverly Hills is the perfect, it's the most beautiful pink color. Um, looks like this. It's, I love it, I love it, I love it. I also really love the color Mood. It's a bit darker than I usually go for, but when I'm tanned, it really, it looks really good. So I feel like now that it's summer, I really need to like really, really use that because then summer will be over and it'll be too dark for me. Also, Refi Beauty. This is the color of Malaya, Malaya, Malaya. Sorry. Also, the most perfect pink. It's so gorgeous. And then we have the Tata Harper Cream Blush. This is the color Naughty and I love it so much. It's a bit of like a darker pink, so it looks really like it just pops. It's so gorgeous. Okay, so which one do I do today? I think I'm going to wear something red. So if I wear something red, maybe I should just tone it down. I'll go with the Refi Beauty again. And no, no, I won't. Oh my God, anxiety. I can't decide. Okay, let's do my brows until then. And when I do my brows, let's just brush them up. I really want, today I'm just feeling like a clear brow. So I just do this. Oh, I think I've already brushed them up because they're super stiff. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I absolutely do not have my shit together right now in my life. I've been a little off. Um, it's just been a lot of things going on in my personal life. Um, so I'm sorry for being a little off. I feel off in this video as well. But at the same time, I super, ugh, I just have a lot of feelings right now. I feel like I'm all over the place. Like one day I'm super happy and then the next day I'm super sad. I guess that's just life. I've been in a really good place in my life though. So now when I'm like right here where I am right now, I just feel so like defeated, which is totally okay. I feel like, you know, the last year has been so weird for everyone. So I feel like everyone is just walking around with a lot of feelings. Um, but yeah. But yeah, sorry. Anyways, hopefully my, you know, everything will, everything will work out. Okay, so which, which blush? Let's just do the refined blush. So this is the color Malaya, Malaya, Malaya. I don't know. I'm using the Merit brush though. I always go over the bridge of my nose, as you know. It's really cute. I don't know if you guys can tell. Okay, this feels like a Refi collaboration, I, I wish, because I love their product so much. But, brace yourself. The best highlighter I have ever used, well, one, top three, top three, is the Refi gloss, the, the highlighter. It's so beautiful. So, it really depends, but because I am going for a date night look, or I mean I'm not going for a date night look, but I'm going for dinner with the fam, so this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can tell that it's gorgeous and i actually really like applying it with this brush from also refi um i don't think that's the brush we were like meant to use but can you guys like see that holy moly i mean and i also like taking a little bit from my forehead this is what it looks like on my hand sunshine here we go I feel like wearing a little bit of mascara today, which you know is like a big deal for me, but I got this new one from Ilya Beauty. It's the fullest volumizing mascara, so I'm really, I'm just really eager to try it, to be honest. Okay, so you're getting like the first impression here. My hair today, it is just in the way. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what it's like. Ooh, I like it. It's cute. It 
It's really nice, right? Where's the camera? I think it's, I really enjoy this. Good, A plus. So Ilia Beauty Fullest Volumizing Mascara looks like this. Obviously, you know, like you can take more. You know, I like the like super easy natural look, but otherwise you can absolutely take more. But this is the finished look. And then we're gonna put lip gloss on the last thing we do. Sun.